In this quickie with Exegius, we're going to look at using the Bug Killer site to collect both raw minerals and data, both used for engineering and synthesis. This site is located on the southern side of the bubble in system HIP-16613 on body 1A. As we'll be landing, you'll likely want to bring a small class ship. The DBX is perfect. However, the terrain isn't that rough, so just about any ship should be able to land just fine. You will need an SRV and detailed surface scanner. Once you arrive in system, target body 1A, as the site will only show once you've probed the planet. As you approach, use your detailed surface scanner to probe the planet, revealing two points of interest, bug killer and crashed SRV. Once you see the POIs, head down to the bug killer site where you'll find three comms control beacons, three cargo racks, and a ship's data core. Unfortunately, unlike the more efficient Jameson crash site, you can't just sit in a single place and scan all of the beacons, so you'll need to move around as you scan. However, unlike the Jameson crash site, there are three cargo racks that can be targeted and destroyed with your turret, revealing a single, generally high-grade raw material each time. This makes the site great if you just need a small amount of data and minerals as well. Be warned that it is very likely a Thargoid interceptor will show up at the site to scan the crashed anaconda and your ship. You aren't in danger, so long as you don't attack the interceptor with your ship. You can even fire your SRV turret directly at the Thargoid without upsetting it. Apparently it just laughs at your tiny weapon. Only a few hundred meters away is the crashed SRV site where you can find and scan an SRV with a message from the commander who died at this site fighting the Thargoids. It's one of the small bits of lore in a game with only small bits of lore. Once you've scanned all three beacons and farmed the cargo racks, perform the frontier flop, logging out to main menu and back in so you can scan and gather data again. If you left out from Ray Gateway and Diagwandri, the closest encoded data trader, you can now destroy your ship to fast travel back or you can simply fly home. This is a great place to gather both data and raw minerals when you only need a few with the possibility of some wonderfully creepy atmospheric gameplay, with the Jameson site for data and Crystal Shard sites for minerals being excellent when you'd like to gather in large quantities. Hopefully between these various sites, you'll be able to gather the engineering and synthesis materials you need quickly and easily. Once again, this has been Commander Exegius reminding you to fly dangerously and thanks for watching. If you need to gather all types of materials, I hope you'll check out my guide covering them all, and that if you're new to the channel, you'll consider subscribing, supporting me here or on Patreon, and that you'll join my weekly live streams.